It is downright cold outside this morning, so we're going to kick things off with cold weather fashion. So naturally, as we transition into the colder months, our clothes choices are going to change. We want to stay warm, but thick, bulky sweaters and other things can really make you feel not that flattering, right? You don't have to bulk up when you bulk up, though. Wardrobe stylist Walla is here with some easy fixes to take pounds off your appearance in the wintertime. Yeah. And you're starting with shapewear, of course. Shapewear, of course. So shapewear is a love-hate relationship, right? We hate to wear it. Everyone hates like to wear it, but you like what it does for you, right? <laughs> right. So the key with shapewear is finding the right size. Shapewear shouldn't be so super tight that it's causing bulges and causing wrinkles and lines that aren't there. The point of shapewear is to give you a nice, clean, smooth line underneath whatever the garment is that you're wearing. That's the whole point of it. But often you need the shapewear to squeeze into whatever you want to wear. So if you need the shapewear to uh -huh. squeeze into what you need to wear, uh -huh. probably you shouldn't, shouldn't wear wearing it. it. Go up a size. All right. <laughs> Noted. Okay, Noted. next update, outerwear. You have some of the newest jacket looks. Yeah, absolutely. So outerwear, look for things that hit you mid-thigh, right? Mm -hmm. Or belt them. So you always want to keep that waist. The more you can accentuate your waist, the slimmer you look. So it actually helps form your body and give you a shape whether you're wearing a big bulky, bulky coat or mm -hmm. sweater or whatever it is, make sure that you can always kind of see your waist underneath it. So the old rule, I feel like my mom always told me, don't have something hit me mid-thigh. Mm -hmm. That's out the window. Mid-thigh right. is cool. Mid-thigh is cool. It actually, like I said, you got to make sure that you're belting it kind of like these pictures that we see so that you still get that waist. If you're going to go anything longer than mid-thigh, make sure that, you know, you're wearing something slim and kind of fitted underneath right. it to still give you a shape. Okay, let's go to our next look because we have a sweater here that I'm guessing you're going to say to let go flowy or not. So this, what we're doing is monochromatic, mm -hmm. right? So okay. if you do one color head to toe, it really elongates your body, gives you one long lean look. Doing something like this is great for fall. You're doing it in a great olive color, pants, shirt, sweater, booties, everything is the same color. It just gives you a nice long lean look. So monochromatic doesn't mean black. Monochromatic black most great, definitely doesn't mean black, especially in the fall. It's fun to play with colors like olive, brown, greens, reds, all those deep kind of emeraldy tones are beautiful in the fall. Just try anything monochromatic. What about hemline? I'm looking at these pants. They look like they'll be shorter and, and the skirt to your right Absolutely. is a little bit longer. So how do you know what hemline is trending? So Hemlines trending is always a great thing to keep an eye on. If you're trying to look slimmer or, you know, create kind of illusions of the body, make yourself look a lot mm -hmm. lighter, you want to make sure that your hemlines for your pants are always hitting somewhere in the ankle. So top of the ankle to the bottom ankle, right? Mm -hmm. If you're talking sleeves, they have said that the quarter sleeve is actually the best kind of like what this you're doing right sleeve. here. That's okay. a quarter length sleeve. So this is the fall. Is the best quarter. to kind of elongate. So it, it's perfect to kind of, again, make you look slimmer, give you those long lean lines. You have a third look in studio, so yeah. let's take a look at this. Absolutely. So another great thing pretty. to kind of switch up the illusion or make you um, look lighter is long vertical lines or patterns uh -huh. that can kind of distract from problem areas. Lots of the, my clients, lots of women always say hips, buns, and thighs, hips, buns, thighs, midsection. Mm -hmm. So a great way to kind of conceal that, especially in the winter months, is do a pattern skirt. So if you do an awesome pattern skirt that's got some sort of vertical pattern in it, it'll again create that long, leaner look and then just keep everything simple so that the attention is going where you need it to go and you appear smaller or um, lighter. Well, and who says you have to go all black on the bottom or just vertical lines. I mean, it's wonderful when a woman shows off her curves. Absolutely. And I love this look, especially when if, if a curvy person embraces their curves. Yes. This would look so nice. Fantastic on someone like that. Definitely. Well, want to ask you about waistline because I'm seeing a lot of high rise pants yes. and high skirts. Absolutely. Are gone the days of the low rider hip huggers. Absolutely gone. So again, we're focusing on winter months. You're trying to look lighter. You're trying to look leaner. A high waist, whether it's a high waist skirt or pants, something that's higher waisted is again going to create that perfect hourglass shape, create a longer, leaner line, make your legs look longer, therefore making you look slimmer. This is such a pretty look, putting the jewelry over the collar I, of the high neck. Yes, I do love that for fall as well. Anything high neck or even if you have an actual collar versus just kind of a, a turtleneck, putting the jewelry on the outside of it again just kind of displays it a little better. 
really great idea. And of course, you say the, the belt for the loose fitting blouses and yes. cardigans. Yes, definitely. Always. So just quick tips on accessories, uh -huh. shoes. If you're going to do like a shoe, do a pointed toe nude, something like that elongates the leg. Belts do something thinner versus one of the big waisted ones, which is just going to make your waist look bigger. Um, long necklaces, long earrings, stuff like that really kind of helps to make you look lighter. As always, if you want to know more about styling, this is your guy right